Today we're gonna build a house, but every room is a different color. So this wheel here is gonna decide the color for us. Let's first start with the outside. Here's the house, by the way. I'm hoping for pink or blue. I'm gonna cover my eyes. I'm scared. Oh, I mean, it could be worse. First, let's decide on the sliding. Oh, oh, oh. The wheel said yellow, so it, it's gonna be yellow. I don't know what to tell you. Do we have a yellow roof trim? No, the answer is no, because why would we have a yellow roof trim? Like the noise that it makes. Boom, boom. Let's change the color of the roof. I really like this, and I feel like it kind of goes well, but like, do we have a yellow one? Oh my God, it's kind of giving like honeycomb. I kind of like it. <laughs> is that weird? Like I kind of think it's cute. You know what? Let's commit. Who said this house has to be pretty? We're committing to yellow. Can we get a platform trim? This one has some yellow in it and it kind of matches these little things we got going on here. Let's get some windows. Do we have yellow windows? Surely not. Because like, why would anyone want yellow windows? <gasps> oh, she's perfect. Oh, I love everything about her. I kind of wish it was white, like around the outside of it. Maybe, well, why don't I just filter items? Aha, we do have yellow windows. <laughs> All right, I like, I'm like. i liking those ones. I want this house to give lemon. I think I'm gonna remove this. Even though like we love her, we love everything about her. <gasps> Perfect. Uh, oh, she's so cute. I feel like this is the most matching windows I have ever seen in my whole entire Sims life. S Sim life, Sim. We put windows on the whole rest of the house. We need a yellow door. Oh, honestly, Mm, not that many picks for yellow doors, kind of sad. Whoa, kind of a vibe. Yeah, we're going with it. We have a yellow tree. It's actually cute. Why have I never seen this tree before? Should I put another one over here? What about bushes? Okay, these are cute. And of course, sunflowers. I mean, like, I think it would literally be illegal not to add some sunflowers. Is it weird that I kind of like it? <laughs> I think we're gonna do the backyard last. Let's add some finishing touches to the outside of our house. Like this little seat here, maybe a coffee table. And last but not least, we gotta add a little car. I couldn't find a yellow one, but orange is close enough. Let's move on to the inside of the house. So the kind of floor plan that I personally was envisioning was kitchen, bedroom for like a grandparent maybe, living room, a office slash study, and under the stairs there will be a bathroom. Oh, maybe we should roll for this entryway because technically this is kind of its own room. It does bleed into the other rooms. I feel like if we're gonna do that, we have to close off the rooms. Let's spin for the entryway, red. First, let's start with some wallpaper. Maybe we could do something fun though. Let's do this color. <laughs> oh, we need flooring. Ooh, a nice red wood maybe. Oh, why does it look so pink? That looks like red for sure. We could do some red tile. We gotta add some entryways actually. So we can't really put too, too much around here. So it's gotta be this one. How does that look on the other side? Not bad, not bad, still pretty neutral. I wanna add a little like drawer slash table. I like to have those by the doors because it feels pretty practical to me to have like just somewhere to like throw your keys, you know? Um, We can add some clutter, we could add a plant, oh, but we could add this by the door. That's kind of cute. Add some books. We can add some shoes by the door. We can add a little rug. Honestly, there's not much else really to put in this area. It's pretty small. We could make the stairs red actually. Oh yeah, that looks Fantastic, that's that's amazing, thank you. Let's move on to the kitchen. Oh, pink, that's not that bad. Pink is actually my favorite color, so pretty stoked about this one. Let's start with the walls. Ooh, what tone of pink do I wanna go for? Do I wanna go for like a hot pink or a pastel? I was thinking more of a pastel-y pink. We could do this for the wallpapers for now, but we can come back to it later. And I know that there's a tile that I wanna use that's pinky. What counts as pink? <gasps> Absolutely, yes, everything about it, yes. The yellow windows are low-key throwing it off, but it's okay, I'm not gonna let it ruin my vibe. I was thinking like counters and stuff over here and then maybe a little island in the middle. Oh, I just realized we don't really have a dining room. I guess we could also make this have a dining space in here somewhere. Maybe actually I put the fridge in this corner, thinking sink here. I feel like our best option is probably to put in one of these slide-in ones. I have zero idea if this is functional, but that's not my problem right now. Or maybe we put the oven here and then the stove or the sink there. I don't know. Yeah, I think I like it better there actually. 
Let's also add a sink, of course. Perfect. Um, we don't really have space for a dining area. We could actually just like scoot back this room and put a dining area there. We gotta add a door to that room. Should we add a unicorn door? I feel like that's the only logical answer is to add a unicorn door, honestly. That works. What else? Let's accessorize. Accessorize, is that the right word for a kitchen? Maybe we'll add in some nice pink lighting. We can add a mat. That's so cute. Why have I never seen that before? I feel like when you actually like filter by colors, you find swatches that you just didn't even know existed. Oh wait, I actually like that one way better. Look how cute this is. Maybe a mat to go under the dining room table as well. Perfect. We could add like a little fake pantry over here or something. Oh, I also just realized that we don't have upper cabinets. Let me add some of those. Okay, now back to this pantry. We need some shelves. Oh, this is kind of cute to put here. It's not really pantry-esque, but I feel like it's pretty cute. I feel like it almost has a vibe, but I feel like our countertops are throwing it off. But I'm just like pretending like it do not exist, honestly. Oh, one more thing. I want to add some curtains here to kind of hide the yellow windows on the inside. Perfect. Now that's our kitchen. Let's move on to this bedroom here. Maybe green. <gasps> oh my God, I'm a psychic. I don't know how this is gonna go. Oh, okay, you know what? They're honestly not terrible. Maybe this is just me lying to myself. Should we use this wallpaper? I feel like we have to. Let's get a bed in here. Now this one's pretty perfect if you ask me. Oh, or we could do this one. Yeah, I like that one a lot better. Maybe a TV and a dresser. This room's a little small, so we're working with what we got. Oh, <gasps> we use the, <laughs> do we use the penguin TV? I feel like we have to, absolutely. A thousand times, yes. Let's add a plant. Do all the plants count as green? Is that what I'm learning today? I finally decided on the plants and I added a little cat plant as well. Maybe we can add a cat bed. Maybe this person has a cat. What is this supposed to be? For some reason in my brain, my brain wants to say avocado, but I feel like that is just so wrong. What else can we give them in here? I don't know, this room is very small. You can give them some curtains. Oh, wow, those are like perfect. And I like that the yellow isn't too like jarring from the rest of the room. Maybe we can give them some artwork. I mean, this wall's already pretty busy if you ask me. Now, remember in the beginning, I did say this room was for a grandma. I don't know if it has those vibes anymore. I feel like it's giving more teenager. I mean, I guess it's just up to your guys' interpretation. Comment who you think would live in this room. And with that, I think we have our room here all finished. I just made us a little bathroom under the stairs here. We got a shower, a toilet, sink, toddler potty. I also had to change a couple things in this first bedroom here because I had to add a door. I also play tested the kitchen and the bathroom and they both work. Now let's roll for the study slash office. I'm hoping for blue. I really thought I was gonna be a psychic two times in a row, but we're doing yellow again. What do we got? We got no yellow floors, huh? Oh, I was wrong. Let's add a computer in here. I was thinking of putting it on this wall. We got ourselves a yellow desk. This chair works great. Perfect. A yellow computer, of course, of course. We gotta add a door. Perhaps we don't have like better yellow doors. What else can we add that is skill building in here? We could add a easel and add a little easel in this corner. Maybe we can add a fun light and some artwork. Let's add a little cloud light in here. Why not? What do we got for yellow plants? Whoop, too big. Ooh, we can add some sunflowers on the desk. Let's add some fun artwork on the wall here. I like that. Maybe we could add some curtains. I think that's it for the study. It's honestly not terrible. I kind of like it. Rolling for the living room. Come on, give us a color that we haven't gotten already. Like blue, purple, oh, blue. I'm literally a psychic, guys. You heard it here first, folks. Okay, blue. Start with a TV. Obviously not too many blue TVs, but we can add this. Oh, maybe we should do flooring first. This could be cool. I think I've actually used this wood in a build before. I actually kind of like it. Let's get us a TV. We get like a nice big one on the wall here. I like that, I like that. 
Oh, so many good options. Maybe we'll change it up, do like a dark blue sofa. We gotta add some cat stuff. Add one of these in the corner. Maybe add a rug. We can do this cool one. Maybe a lamp. Hmm, what can we add back here? We could add a litter box for said cat, even though that would kind of suck to have a litter box in here. But I mean, if it's, a, it, we'll add the auto cleaning one. We can add this little cute kitty one. For sure, we gotta add some artwork in here. It's pretty dull, if you ask me. We could add something like this on the wall. That'll definitely take up quite a bit of space. Maybe add a tiny like bookshelf, just some books on this little coffee table thing right here. That works. Oh, let's add some curtains. Let's actually move this cat bed thing because now it's kind of in the way. We could put it like back here. So like the cat can like sit on it and like watch TV with the owners maybe. I think that's it for the living room. Now we're gonna be moving upstairs. We've got this little like hallway area. We've got bedroom number one two and a bathroom. Let's roll for this hallway area. I'm hoping we get a color that we haven't gotten yet, like orange maybe. Can I guess the color again? Oh, close. It's gonna be red, I think. Yeah, it's red. Right, let's see. Can we add in here? We can add this like rose wallpaper. Go a little, go a little crazy. We can add that red flooring up here because the lighting's a little bit better. Gotta get some curtains on these windows to cover them up because they look so bad. I feel like this upstairs part's giving grandma vibes at the moment, but I'm kind of here for it. We should definitely add somewhere to sit here or maybe even another computer. Two computers though. We can always add one into one of the bedrooms. So let's not do that. But maybe like a little cozy, like reading nook area. It's too too big. Is that going through the wall? Most definitely it is. Oh, and I also need a door here. Dang it, can't have anything I want. Let's just do this, I guess, I don't know. I don't know really what to put up here. We definitely need to put some wallpaper on these side walls, or sorry, not side walls, half walls. You give them a little red top part of them, cute. I like that. I don't really know what else to do. There's not really much space. I could put a plant, put that there. I think I'm just gonna do this plant and call it, call it there. We could actually, you know what, we'll add a rug and then, the, and then we'll call it there. All right, so let's move on to this bedroom. You know what? We have three rooms left. Let's just remove everything. Let's remove all of the colors that we've already done. Okay, I switched it so we only have four colors. We only have purple, orange, blue, and green now. So let's hope we get one that we haven't done. Purple, what do we got for purple flooring, huh? Should we do this? Absolutely, yes, we should. This is supposed to be the master bedroom though, which is kind of unfortunate because I was gonna say we could use this penguin wallpaper, but maybe we should try to make it somewhat mature if that's even possible. I have no idea how we're gonna possibly make this room mature with this color. Honestly, we're going purple dinos. Purple dinos, yeah. Let's get them a bed. I've made this room quite small, so I'm hoping that the Sim that lives in here knows how to scooch. Let's add a door. Oh, not much purple doors, huh? Guess we could do this one. Oh, and it looks normal on the outside. Love that. We could probably fit a another computer in here. We'll add in a dresser, maybe a TV. I guess that works. I'm trying to get a dresser in here. I mean, okay, let's just actually just put a desk, honestly. We don't need to put a computer, but we'll put a desk. Can they get around there? Surely, let me scooch. Just a nice little desk with a cute little chair. Oh, we can make it a vanity. Let's add a plant next to the bed or on the vanity, get sidetracked, add it to the vanity. None of the purple plants are big enough. This one's okay, I guess. I want the makeup clutter. Perfect. Let's get some purple curtains in here, shall we? Hmm, I don't have a lot of good options. The tone of the room is a bit weird. So our options are kind of limited. This kind of works. If this counts as purple, then sure. <laughs> we could add a rug, add the turtle rug. Honestly, the wall is so busy, I don't even need any artwork. Oh, this one's actually kind of cuter. I'm gonna go with this rug instead. And this is our bedroom. Let's remove purple. Since we only have two rooms left, let's spin for blue, orange, or green. We're doing green. That counts as green, that counts as green, honestly. I'm thinking of making this bedroom like a kid's bedroom. Ooh. Did we just go like ham with the geometric shapes? <laughs> Maybe we could get like two kids beds in here. We got a green bunk bed. That like fits perfect. Oh, but where's the door going? It could go here or we could do bunk beds like this. Let's get some curtains on the windows. Oh, we need a door. I always forget about the doors. We should do this one. So it looks normal on the outside, but funky on the inside. 
Oh, it's still green on the outside. That's okay. We could add a dresser here. And then we could add like a little chair here and then we could add a little like TV and they can like game there. That would be cool. Oh, we got to add this one. That one's fun. Oh, but they can't get up to the ladder. Can I slip it around? Aha. <laughs> I'm going to scoot it more this way so that hopefully they can actually access this bottom bed here. Got to add. <gasps> what? Oh, won't slot right when it's right here. That's kind of making me upset. Oh, this is too perfect. We'll give them a little gaming console. And then let's add some like fun posters and stuff. Some of these, size these down. And with that, I think we're done this room. It looks pretty cute. Last but not least, we are gonna do the bathroom. And I don't think I'm gonna spin because we already did a room that's blue. So I think I'm just gonna do orange for this bathroom. Let's start with a door. That's pretty cute. Let's add this bunny door. Or actually, let's just add this regular one. <laughs> orange tiles. Almost all the tiles come in orange, so this is easy peasy. What about wallpaper? Oh wow, not that many for wallpapers, huh? We could do this, or we could do this. <gasps> that is so cute. Oh my God, I didn't even know that was a thing. I'm thinking shower, toilet, sink. This apparently counts as orange. We have a tub downstairs. We don't need two tubs. Let's use this one. That one is definitely more orange. There's an orange toilet, apparently. Let's add this little potty too, as well as we should definitely add in a litter box. Everyone poops together, you know, adult, baby, cat. <laughs> Let's add in this little guy. Let's add in a mirror. I love this wallpaper. I never knew it existed before, but these little hearts are so cute. Add that. What else can we add in here? We can add some a towel we can add in some storage on this wall here we could put a little towel maybe we can get a rug in here that one's pretty nice let's get some curtains and here is our orange bathroom this house is sure something <gasps> oh my god you know what i totally forgot about the backyard let's put all the colors back and then we can roll for the backyard let's spin for the backyard purple I was thinking we could do a little fenced in type area. So what do we got for purple fence, if any? Oh my God, you have purple fence? I'm actually shocked. I'm thinking we add a pool. I feel like that makes the most sense to me. <laughs> it looks like a playpen. We got no purple pools, obviously. We won't do a huge pool. Do we have a purple pool trim? Oh, we do. Let's get some purple. Oh, yes, a purple tree back here. Of course, of course. Get some purple hedges on the back of the house. Do we have a purple barbecue? Ah, <laughs> uh, hell yeah. This definitely counts as a barbecue. So it's going there. Let's get some seating. Some seats by the pool. Get this little picnic bench right here under the tree. Put these at the bottom of the pool. Perfect, perfect. Get a little chest for maybe the cats go outside. I don't know. I don't know what the cats do. They be playing outside, apparently. Get some beach towels out. Oh, some floaties, of course. A swing set. That is not purple, but it has purple in it. That's why it's counting it as purple, so... Works for me. What else can we add? Oh, what about this thing? Let's add these to the back of the chairs for some shade. Maybe I wanna add a little bit of concrete in the back here. I feel like having a barbecue on grass is not a good idea, even though I know that lots of people do it, but like for some reason, my brain thinks it's a bad idea. I added a little bit of terrain paint and I think we're done with the backyard, which means we're done with the whole house. So we have the outside, which is yellow the entryway, which was red, the kitchen, which was pink, the bedroom that is green, red bathroom. We got a blue living room, a yellow study, a red hallway, a purple bedroom, a green bedroom, a yellow washroom, and a purple backyard. Comment down below which room is your favorite, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Since you're still here, you should go check out the description to find all my other social medias. Okay, thanks. Bye.